Hi there! My name is Ola, and in this Lens Studio tutorial, I'll be showing you how to use the pad template. The pad template lets you create a lens that adds images to cat or dog faces. The template allows you to attach images to a pet's eyes, nose, and center of the head. First, open Lens Studio and select the pad template to create a new project. With the pet template open, we're going to switch the preview video to one with a cat or dog. In the preview panel, press the image video mode button. Then in the drop down at the top of the preview panel, select the cat and dog, dog or cat preview video. You should now see the template working with content applied to the cat or dog's face. To edit the content of the pet template, First, select the Pet Tracking Controller object in the Objects panel in the left side of Lens Studio. We are then going to adjust the settings of this selected object in the Inspector panel towards the right side of Lens Studio. For this template, ignore the Scene panel in the center. We'll always be selecting the Pet Tracking Controller object in the Objects panel and tuning its settings in the Inspector panel. The pet template offers three types of tracking, which can be configured via the tracking type drop down. The cat tracking type will apply content to a cat found in the camera. The dog tracking type will apply content to a dog found in the camera. The cat or dog tracking type will apply content to either a cat or a dog found in the camera. Let's select cat or dog so that our lens experience will apply to both. Next, we can enable or disable the tracking points, including right eye, left eye, nose, and center of the head. When enabled, you are able to configure the attached to D texture to the tracking point. Let's replace the eyes on the cat with my own custom texture. To do this, let's first import my custom texture by dragging and dropping it into the resources panel. Then. With the pet tracking controller object enabled, let's assign the right eye and left eye textures to the newly imported texture. With the sliders in the inspector panel, I can control the attached to the image's size, offset, rotation, and alpha transparency. While the pet template gives you a very simple system for attaching images to the pet tracked points and configuring the tracking type, Pet tracking can also always be added outside of the pet template. To demonstrate this, I'm going to create a new empty project by selecting File, New Project from the Lens Studio menu bar. Then, in the Objects panel, select Add New, Object Tracking, Cat Tracking to create a cat tracked object. This will open the 2D scene, allowing you to configure the image's position, scale, and rotation. Additionally, you can select the object tracking parent to set the attachment point on the cat's face to center, left eye, right eye, or nose. Use this technique if you want to add pet tracking to an existing project. Thanks for watching and have fun creating your own lenses for cats and dogs.